The last time Lorient and Clermont met was in the Ligue 2 BKT and a 1-0 victory for Clermont on that occasion. This is the first ever meeting between both clubs in the French top flight. Lorient enjoyed their best start to a top flight campaign since 2012 and have only lost once this season. That was against Montpellier. This is a clash between clubs with opposite runs of form. Lorient have won their last seven at the Stade du Moustoir, whereas Clermont have conceded 13 on the road in their last three games. Despite their poor record away from their home base, it was the visitors who took the lead. Mohamed Bayo scoring his fifth goal of the campaign in the 15th minute. Lorient caught napping at the back. And the punishment was almost immediate. The home side looked to respond. Moffi, one of the danger men for them, the Nigerian. Desmas just diving over the ball. Moffi didn't actually connect with him at all. But the referee not giving any sanction to the Merlu striker. Clermont had the opportunity to double their lead. Once again, Bayo working well on the right flank. And this time, a good save by Nardi. Tame shot by Bayo, who, had he hit the ball cleaner, could have probably doubled the lead for Clermont just before the break. As it stood, just a one goal in the first 45 minutes. An opportunity for both teams to regroup at the interval. In the second half, Lorient up the pressure, looking for that equaliser. And it was an equaliser that came shortly afterwards. Julien Laporte, the defender scoring against his former club. Hence the muted celebration. Desmas this time can't do anything to keep the ball out. Lorient even had the opportunity to win the match. Moffi once again involved. But he was not quick enough to reach the ball. And this time the Clermont goalkeeper alert enough to come and claim it well. Clermont kept on coming forwards and it was an opportunity at the other side with penalty appeals it did look like there was a tangle of legs but the referee didn't give anything point shared at the Stade du Moustoir Clermont were better in the first half but then sat back in the second Lorient chased the equaliser and deservedly got it